Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome along to this tutorial video which is around a smart co-pilot from Sky for Crew. This is the first part of the tutorial and it's sort of a question and answers what is a smart co-pilot and what can I expect from it. A smart co-pilot, if, if you're an X-Plane 11 user and you've ever wanted to fly with someone else in the cockpit with you you've not been able to but this it's smart copilot gives you the ability it's a mod it's an add-on that will give you to some degree a shared cockpit now it's not a fully complete multiplayer plug-in that is simple to use. I will say immediately this is a real Simmers product. If you've been using X-Plane for a while and you understand tweaking and configuring and having to, to try things out, to test things, to be able to get them to work, you'll understand what Smart Copilot and how to set it up. It's not it doesn't work straight out of the box. It certainly does not work straight out of the box. And unless you've got a little bit of computer understanding, you're pre it is very difficult to set up. Now, effectively, one of you, the effectively the way I use the product or I found the product works best is if the master who, the master connection will have the best internet connection shall we say um, it works on the premise of a master slave connection so one of you is going to be the master one of you is going to be the slave and as I say I predominantly do it master sits in the pilot seat the slave sits in the co-pilot seat um, the master generally has control of the aircraft full control of the aircraft whereas the co-pilot has to request the controls from the pilot. Um, both pilots have control of the radios, the flaps and various other functions but only one pilot will have control of the actual aircraft controls if you like, the uh, the throttles, the pitch and yaw and the rudder, rudder pedals. With that in mind You both have to have the configuration file as we've stated, as we'll state in another part of the tutorial. It's not gonna it's not a straight out of the box multiplayer plug-in that works with every aircraft in X Plane. As as far from what it is. It's a very it's a select aircraft and it it is a technically tricky product to set up. I will I will say I have 20 years of IT experience I've built some very technical IT systems and I understand computer systems way above and beyond the average person so with that said this isn't for the younger generation this isn't for for kids who just want to get together and jump in a cockpit together and go and crash at the earliest convenience you're effectively the people who are going to be looking to this product are airliner pilots who understand checklists because uh, you are ideally going to be using both pilots are going to use the same checklist so that you understand you have clicked the same switch you are going to check that that switch is checked um, so it's it's all about having an extra set of hands in the cockpit that can help you but also having an extra set of eyes in the cockpit which will confirm the procedures that you perform in a in a in an, uh, an aeroplane stroke airliner so please bear that in mind don't don't take this product lightly it it really isn't but also don't be put off because when you do get the connection working and when you do have a solid flight there is nothing more rewarding than completing that flight with another person. You both feel ecstatic 
uh, and you can't wait to do it again. Thanks ever so much. See you in the next part.